Since the charity began in 2011, we have done some amazing things. It's just been quite unbelievable. A plea came up for a little dog living in Romania in a box in a forest. The plea was from a lady that we now know as Madalena, and she was asking for some money. It could have been a scam. It could have been somebody that wasn't going to help the little dog. We took a leap of faith. I sent the 40 euros, and it turned out that Madalena was an amazing lady. We rehomed the little dog and then that's how Canine Angels was founded. You're alone and scared, life's been so hard on you. There's no hope in your eyes and nobody wants you Please don't feel so lost Cause there's nothing wrong with you It's what people do Let's now introduce you to girls who truly are considered by many as angels They are canine angels, Victoria and Paula Welcome both to it started, uh, Paul and myself and Annika started with, with the founders and we now have a really strong team. All these ladies, um, it actually gets me emotional talking about it. They give up so much. They do so much for these dogs. But there is a huge network of rescuers that we mm. cooperate with. It's not just the three of us, not just the six of us. Exactly what do you do, girls? We do everything from rehoming to raising funds. We've built a shelter in Romania, do spay -thons. We send money out regularly so the ladies in Romania can feed the dogs. We send medical supplies. I mean, we literally do absolutely everything. So I've got a lot to thank, uh, well, for having been on my brother, but mostly Victoria and the lovely ladies at Canine Angels. And uh, we've also got Victoria from the Canine Angels. Hello, Victoria. Hello, Joe. The Canine Angels. Hi, am I Canine Angels? Hi, am I Let's talk to you about something that's very close to my heart. That's your dog. No, it's not. If I want to do a shout out to somebody who contacted me recently, a charity called K9 Angels, who protect a lot of dogs who have been treated really, really badly. I'm Lucy Watson from Made in Chelsea. I'm a huge animal lover and I did uh, a couple of interviews around the Newland Meat Festival. The Rock Moon Meat Dog Festival involves the slaughter of dogs and cats and takes place every August in South Korea. There's 2.5 million dogs going to be boiled, skinned and electrocuted. They're taken, they're put in shoot crates and one by one in front of the other dogs that they're taken out and they're brutally killed. Yes. Um, and they make soup from them. Yeah. In the last four and a half years we've rehomed 800 dogs. We've spayed and neutered about 3,000. We've built a shelter in Romania. We've done a school tour of the UK. Spay and neuter campaign. It's not a good start in life. It's really not a good start in life being shown a stick and being pushed out like that. Oh my god, it's so small. Oh my god, it's tiny. As the days go by, your eyes start to smile again. And the wonders of the world open up your little soul. I just can't believe how wonderful you are You're a star And I want everyone else to know What is your story and where you came from So let's go out Welcome home.